John Adams, the second president of the United States, was a fascinating and influential figure in American history. Here are five fun facts about him. Adams and Thomas Jefferson's friendship Despite being political rivals, John Adams and Thomas Jefferson developed a deep and enduring friendship later in life. Both served on the committee responsible for drafting the Declaration of Independence and became close friends during their time in France. Their friendship waned during the intense political battles of the late 18th century but was rekindled through correspondence in their later years. Remarkably, Adams and Jefferson both died on the same day, July 4, 1826, exactly 50 years after the adoption of the Declaration of Independence. Adams and Abigail's love letters, John Adams and his wife, Abigail Adams, maintained a remarkable and well-documented correspondence throughout their marriage. Their letters, spanning more than a thousand, provide insights into the political and personal challenges of the time. Abigail's letters to John often contained astute observations and advice, showcasing her intellect and influence on his decisions. Their correspondence is considered a treasure trove of historical information and a testament to their enduring love and partnership. Adams penchant for neologisms, John Adams had a fascination with language and often coined new words, known as neologisms. Some of his creations include terms like unitedness and factology. While not all of his linguistic experiments gained widespread usage, they reflect his intellectual curiosity and love for the English language. Adam's role in the XYZ affair During Adam's presidency, the United States faced tensions with France, leading to an incident known as the XYZ affair. Adams sent envoys to France to negotiate but French officials demanded bribes before talks could begin. Adams, upon learning of this, referred to the French agents as X, Y, and Z in diplomatic correspondence, keeping their identity secret. The XYZ affair heightened anti-French sentiment in the United States and led to an undeclared naval war between the two nations. Adams' White House Menagerie John Adams was the first president to reside in the newly constructed White House in Washington, D.C. During his presidency, the White House was not only the seat of government but also home to a diverse array of animals. Adams' son, John Quincy Adams, kept silkworms in the East Room in an attempt to start a domestic silk industry. Additionally, there were horses, dogs, and a pet alligator in the bathroom. The menagerie reflected the Adams family's varied interests and the informal atmosphere of the early White House, 